everyone! So something I noticed a lot of players don't know about, or maybe don't know how to do, are how to make trial characters. So I just wanted to do a quick instructional video, you know, what they are, how to make them, and just some extra information about trial characters, so keep watching, you know, if that's something you want to know how to do. Before I get in too much explaining how to make a trial character, I need to answer the most important question people have. What exactly is a trial character, anyway? A trial character is a standardized character with a standardized level, standardized SP, standardized gear, that is meant to provide players with a gear matched level at which they can practice with others and also to engage with some content that less geared people might not be able to do and have fun with. Like if you go into RBF with less than 620 gear score, you're probably gonna have a bad time, but you can make a trial character and take that character in with you. Or if you just want to test out a new class, you know, in BA, in small duels, or in RBF large scale, you can make a trial character, fill up your skill tree, and immediately start practicing on it before you dedicate to rolling. So now that I've covered the basics of what exactly a trial character is, you know, now let's talk about how to actually go and make one. To access trial characters, first go to your character selection screen. Up at the top right there will be two types of characters, standard and trial. Go to your trial slot. The one crappy thing with trial characters is you can only have three slots. But in December, they finally changed it so that instead now of taking 24 hours to delete a trial character, it's only three minutes. If you get the error message that you can't delete the character because you have pearl items in the inventory, just trash the costumes it gives you. Once those are out of your inventory, you should be able to delete your character with no problem and it'll only take three minutes till you can make your next trial character. Now that you have an open slot, you can go and you can make a trial character. The UI is just like the normal character creation UI. And when you make your new trial character, there is a prep checklist of things you want to do. First, head to the trial vendor and pick up your items. Get the Arsha 2 chest. People who haven't been on their trial characters for a while will also have to get this Arsha 2 chest in addition to new trial characters. Make sure you get your pots. Just get a few thousand of them. Don't stock up on only a hundred, there's no reason. Just load up on your pots. You'll also want the food buff, the villa buff, alk stones, perfumes, and droughts. And once you've got all your Arsha 2 gear equipped, your APDP should be around 270, 350, depending on what journals you've finished. Make sure you equip one of the Arsha costumes too. You can pick either movement speed or crit. When you've got your items and outfit equipped, start filling in your skill tree. If you're not familiar with the class, make sure to get advice about what needs to be locked or hotbarred and what rebombs to take. Always make sure to lock your evasion, it's down under your secondary skills. To quickly invest in all skill levels, use shift and left click, and to de-invest, use shift right click. After you fill in your skill tree, make sure to get your skill add-ons from the trial vendor. And finally, a couple funny things about trials. So although trials come set at level 30 breath, strength, and health, your breath and health can actually increase if you play on them enough. Trials only come with a set amount of silver, but there's a trick to restock your funds without having to make a new character. Go around the BA gathering wild herbs, then when you're in Arena of Arsha, as your match is about to start, sell your gathered items to the NPC behind the gates. I hope this little guide was helpful. Please let me know in the comments what other quick guides you'd like to see.